Guys, so welcome back to the channel. We're playing some more Infinite Wealth. So we're about to actually do some serious missions. Last part was kind of crazy, just because we're doing all like the crazy mini games. But we're about to head to the Barricada Hideout. I'm already outside the place, and these guys are like beating my ass. So yeah, I'm trying to finish this fight. There is a restaurant right there called Lipstick, I think. I can't see the text. But, damn, here just killed that guy. Someone has to die. Okay, that guy's dying. Jesus Christ. Okay. Let's just hurry up and kill this guy before he kills us. There we go. There we go. Okay. Yeah, we're all so low. Hopefully we can just eat and then... I ranked up nice. Okay. Yeah, this is a restaurant we can go to. Hopefully I can just go in here and eat. Well, at least the crowd's friendly. Gonna guess you're Roman? And I'm gonna guess you're new in town. Welcome to Hawaii, pal. Seems you're quick to make friends. The taco guy told me all about you. Uh. Yeah, he said there's some real snaky people trying to join the Barracudas. <laughs> Good old Jeff. Always looking out for his fellow citizens. This guy's Look at carry you in the back. <laughs> Do all American cops love to hear themselves talk? Jeff, you dirty, stinking asshole. I'll tell you right now, we're not interested in joining a gang. All we want is to get into District 5 and get out. We heard you could make that happen. Oh, you did? Well, I do lead a regular patrol there, but come on. Do I look like the type to go around making backroom deals? And you, you're that John Doe who bolted out of the station. I don't think you're in any position to be asking me favors, especially concerning District 5. Tell me something, Roman. You a family man? And why should you care? I just thought a bright, honest cop like yourself might have a family waiting at home. I envy that, you know? Well, I do have a bombshell of a wife. But my son, there's my pride and joy. Kid's turning 20 this year. How <laughs> time flies. Yeah, it's funny, he keeps asking me for a sports car. What he wants is 50 grand. Can you believe it? I mean, I'm just a glorified beat cop. You know how little they pay me? If only there was someone sound like our friend? There, some... Kind oh, no, money wants to buy his car. Wish. Oh, but surely there's no one that generous. <laughs> Did he really just ask for 50 grand? <laughs> Maybe Jeff's not such an asshole after all. So what's it gonna be? Feeling generous today? The way I see it, you boys don't have much of a choice. I'm sure you noticed, but me and my guys run the show here. One wrong move might land you a trip to the coroner's office. <laughs> Whatever happened to protect and serve, huh? Roman. If all you're after is money, You'll have to try someone else. Now, I suggest you take us to District 5 before things get out of hand. <laughs> what did you just say? Also, we'll need his record cleared of any and all false charges. You're hardly the first cop I've seen point a gun. But the ones I know only do it to save a life, to uphold the values they believe in. Stay back. Maybe I have no right to say this, but seeing scum like you hold a badge, it makes me sick. I said stay back! Well, that was reckless. All I'm doing is talking, and yet you pop one off. Don't just stand there. Tomizawa. Ready for action? Huh. Never been more ready. Man, I came here to eat. <laughs> I'm no so need to low. Go soft, boys. I want to see these fuckers in a coma. Oh shit! Here we go, man. I'll teach you some respect. Yeah, I don't know if oh, I could wait, actually wait, do this. Yeah. Jesus Christ, this music's actually kind of crazy. Yeah, you suck. Oh, 
Let's see, what do we do, man? Okay, I know what to do. We gotta catch your toes, Hang on. Oh, never mind. I'm trying to do this. Damn, holy sh 200? We can call this guy, too. Let's see. Yeah, we are so done for. I mean, I can eat. Let's see. So I just need Ichiban alive, right? Can I? Is there one that heals like everybody? Let's take a look. Okay, so. Damn, I don't know what to do. I think. Yeah, we'll heal Ichiban. Much better. Not out yet. And then. Should we go for Roman? It looked like he was like level 1, but he's level 11. Okay. Time to Fight these menacing men. There we go. Damn, I didn't power that up. I messed. I thought it was the spamming one, so I kept pressing it. Okay. So this move would be nice. I can get like almost all of them with it. Okay. I need Ichiban to go again. Jesus Christ. Survive. Oh, damn. Come on, Kiryu, don't die. Yeah, okay, he's done for. Jesus Christ. I'm not sure if Ichiban can actually solo this. Jesus Christ. Oh, no, shoots. Oh, wait, hang on. I got a plan. So... We can use this. To get Kiryu up. Does he get a turn? Okay, no, he doesn't. Still do this. He's in the way. Okay, thank God they didn't secure you. Oh, yeah, that was a waste. Jesus Christ. Damn. That mega swing would be so good here, man. Let's see. Fuck it, man. I don't want a game over. Someone try to solo this as one. I just need mana. Peacekeeper. Yeah, that gun is so weak. I remember Ishiyoto's gun was so crazy. Okay. I don't have any mana, man. <laughs> They're just harassing this dude. Okay. Oh, we can knock this guy back and get two guys. Nice. Oh shit. Yeah. Oh nice. Uh, do I have anything that doesn't oh this would be really nice. I don't wanna waste that though. We'll check this out. Alright. Nice. There's just two guys left. This fight, I don't think it should have been so hard. This could be it. <laughs> Just that we were came here so low. Okay. It should be easier now since we're not gonna jump anymore. Okay. Hopefully this kills them. Miss, really? You boys are not. Oh, he's reloading. Nice. Critical hit raise. Okay. Get this guy out of here. Nice. Please don't crit. Oh, that's still pretty weak. Damn, it takes 20. Okay, I just gotta live for a few more turns. Okay, nice. You can heal. I'm gonna kill. Jesus. How much does this even heal? Only 90. Damn. Clan fire. Damn, what a shitty cop. Right. Jesus this Christ. You know what? Fuck it, man. We're gonna use... Actually. Yeah, we use this one. To kid you up. Guess it's not my nope, please don't each one. Actually, each one needs to live. Oh, thank God. <laughs> This is actually kind of crazy now. Alright, now it can be disaster. 
How did Q not get hit? I can beat his ass now. Oh shit! I didn't realize. Oh yeah, Kira would have been so nice in this. He's next to a wall. Cool. Okay. Oh yeah, there we go. Jesus Christ, Kira does a lot to him. Yeah, just stay next to the wall. Oh fuck, no! Oh my god, what if I died from that? Here we go. Okay. Fuck it. What's he doing? He's like getting position. He's gonna shoot. Oh, he had to break that. Nice. This could be it. Okay, here's this. Oh, nice kill, kick him. Allow me. Okay, wall. Okay. I'm gonna make this quick. Come on. No choice. I'm gonna shut you Oh, he got carry you? Damn. He's gonna heal up. Let's rock! Downtown Let's Justice. What the hell? Jesus! <laughs> what the fuck was that? Open one! There is that. Yeah, I think we should be good. Just like a couple more auto attacks. And down on Justice, just attacking my killing. Jesus. I better make this quick. If this doesn't kill him, I'll be fucked. Let me see one of these. Oh, nice. Oh, if I knew he was reloading, I could have finished him, man. Oh, yeah. Fuck that, dude. 260? Holy shit. Learning more every day. Now it's actually hard for no reason. Why'd you do that? Uh, do what? You nearly got your head blown off just now! Oh! <laughs> True that. Close one, huh? <laughs> More than close, dumbass! How the hell can you just throw your life away? The hell? <sighs> no brainer, man. I'd take a bullet for a bud any day. <sighs> oh, uh, which reminds me, how's the hair? Ah, oh, shit, don't tell me. Curie son, I don't have a bald patch, do I? I think the bullet ripped a chunk out. Does it look bad? Hmm, can't say I see any difference. The tips are a bit burned, but your hair looks like it's seen more bullets than one. What? Because it's standing up on end? Look, pal, I'll have you know this is a custom job, okay? Special order, top of the line cut. I paid money for They're this. They're on another level. Let me get this straight. Not only are you a Barracuda pawn, you've been using your position to frame people? I asked you a question. Yeah, that's right. And Tomizawa and Kasuga here are two of your latest victims? <sighs> yeah, what of it? Goddamn son of a bitch! Tomizawa, save that anger for the Barracudas. You'd only be wasting it on him. Oh, fuck! Listen up. You're gonna wipe every last charge your boys gave me. Right now? I can't even take a step on this beautiful island without looking over my shoulder. And that pisses me off. All right. Fine. Thank you, officer. Don't forget. 
We also need access to District 5. You don't know what you're asking. It's not some asinine tourist trap. Believe me, we're not here to play around. We're looking for a girl who's in there. I'll level with you. I can get you in, simple enough. But if the Barracudas found out, there'd be hell to pay. <laughs> you saying they're a bigger threat than I am? Think about that carefully. Okay, okay, let's just be cool here, yeah? Meet me tomorrow in front of District 5. Be there at noon, on the dot. That's more like it. In Hawaii, public indecency's a thousand dollar fine, right? Here. Sorry I won't buy you a sports car. Then where'd you get all those money? <sighs> Hear you, son. I don't have the words right now, man. Finally, I can walk around free. Looks like you're off the hook for now. Maybe thank Tomizawa sometime. Hmm. All right. Okay, that was some crazy ass boss fight. Okay, so we're gonna go back in there. Oh shit. Let me go in and eat real quick. Then this place is back to business. Okay. They just sell beef jerky like that. Okay, let's eat everything we can. Okay, there we go. Oh, I'm starving. Let's oh, dig in. Let's eat. Yeah. No table great. talk yet? Damn, man. When are we going to get that? Have a good one. Okay, have a good one. Let's get out of here. Oh, let's steal some shit under the car. Hmm? Oh, nice iron plates. There's actually hella hmm? people. Okay. Let's get the hell out of here, guys. So we're finally good health, so I don't have to worry about getting my ass beat anymore. Let's get out of this place. So we gotta get back to the hotel. Let's go ahead and just walk over there. Oh yeah. I keep forgetting we got this. Just look at us, man. This shit looks so funny. You can auto cruise, which is really nice. So you can like just chill out, you know, while you're riding this. Damn, this shit's faster than the car. Holy shit! All right, so here we are. Hey. I actually really like the whole cruising thing. You can just look around and just chill. All right, grab this. Ooh, is that a weapon we can equip? Hang on. Let's see gears, Kazuka. Where would it be? I don't know. I don't know what the hell we just picked up. Okay. What kind of bow does a cure you use anyways? Bare hands. Okay, we'll just leave them. Uh, <sighs> <sighs> oh, what a day. I think I could uh, sleep for a week. Uh, oh. I hear you. Me, I could sleep for double that. Oh. How are you still on your feet, Kiryu-san? I guess you're just built different, huh? I wouldn't say that. I'm barely holding up myself. <laughs> you know what? After today, I think we all could use a drink to lift our spirits. There is ice in the freezer. As for glasses... You can find some in the bar. Oh, yeah! <laughs> I'll just grab a couple of these. <sighs> Thanks. <sighs> you really held your own today, Tomizawa. <laughs> hey, I've been around the block, man. And one morning, I'm rolling with you, my next day. <laughs> Sharing a roof with you two. And soon, we'll be deep in District 5. It's crazy how life switches it up on you. Sorry to drag you into all this. It's a lot. You didn't drag me into nothing. Yeah, I figure this is just part of getting my life together. 
For real, though, you guys really did save my life. Maybe even my damn soul. And damned or not, I'm not just gonna bail on you. Not after what you did. So, sorry for the inconvenience, but you're stuck with me. <laughs> <laughs> I'll drink to that. Though, you sure you're okay with what happened? Cutting ties with Yumai and all? Remember what you said at the house? I had a choice, and I made it. Only reason I joined his little syndicate in the first place is because I couldn't pay back what I owed him. And then before I knew it, I was 30, with nothing to show for it. Age doesn't mean squat. It's never too late to turn a new leaf, no matter how heavy it is. You... you think so? Totally. Just look at me, man. I was locked up for 18 years, and when I got out, I was in my 40s. And ever since then, it's been... Uh, how should I put it? <laughs> it's been one wild ride. So chin up, Tommy. I'm sure you'll be just fine. Did you just call me Tommy? Yeah, Tommy. As in Tommy's hour. Dude, that's lame as hell. I mean, you could just call me Eric. What? Uh, Tommy's perfect for you. Kiryu's on. Back me up. <laughs> Can't say much for the nickname thing. But you're right about turning a new leaf. As long as you stick to it. You'll find yourself in a better place. Uh, oh, sorry. I, I should have poured you in first. <laughs> uh, you good with it on the rocks? No, thanks. I like to feel the heat. <laughs> Anyhow. Just be aware that everything has to end sometime. You can always turn a new leaf, but you can't turn back the clock. All you get is the precious time you're given. That's why you've got to live every last moment to the fullest. I figured I knew that well enough already. But to my surprise, I still had a lot left to learn. Uh, curious, huh? Did... something happen? Yeah. If anyone deserves to know, it's the guys who have my back. Thing is... I've got cancer. <gasps> Seems I've got half a year left, at most. Oh shit. Damn. That was one crazy ass chapter in the ghetto. Are they ever gonna explain his white hair? Is it just cause he's getting old or I don't know. Cause Majima and everyone else looks the same. working in a temporary waste storage facility for decommissioned reactors. The forklift driver had a sudden heart attack. One accident Dumbass. led to another. You got a death wish? Forget the rest and get out ASAP! The drums weren't filled with much. 
contaminated dirt, worn out components, protective suits. As far as radioactive waste goes, it was low risk. Low enough for no immediate harm, as far as experts were concerned. In light of that, there is no certainty it was the cause. The cancer could have come from just about anywhere. Hold up. What are you doing in a friggin' reactor? This is nuts. This is how I chose to make amends. Leaving my old life behind meant living in the shadows for good. Every time I stepped into the light, the people I loved got hurt. It had to stop. Trouble is, there's not a lot you can do in the dark. Not a lot of good, anyway. So, this was your answer to all that? Yeah. This was something I chose. Hardest part was convincing that I told you to let me do it. And this is much bigger than me. Right now, that reactor's full of people willing to step up and do the work that needs to be done. All I wanted was to play a part however I could. Otherwise, I probably would have wasted away into nothing by now. That's about the smartest thing I could think of. You know, being educated on the streets and all. Are you sure there's not some mistake? All you've got is half a year? Yeah. The last thing I wanted was to make a big deal out of it. But then I figured it wouldn't be right if I kept this from you guys. Yeah. I don't know. You seem like you're in good shape to me. <laughs> well, I can still haul ass when need be. <clears throat> that said, I need to pick my battles wisely for my health. Uh, so, is that why back at Akane's, you weren't exactly spoiling for a fight with Yamai? Yeah. <laughs> Though. I am a bit hurt. <laughs> you really think I'd pick a random fight that easy? This shit's unreal. you son Of all people... Man! You don't have time to be out here wrecking yourself like this! What you need right now is a doctor! Believe me, I've gone. Apparently the cancer spread. Metastasized, they called it. Nothing any surgery can fix. They gave me some pills to ease things, but that's it. Still, if you're sick, then you need to be getting your rest. You said it's the Daidoji faction calling the shots here? Well, I've got some words for them. Kasuga. No, I'll make this right! Kasuga. It's not like that. <sighs> my being here and everything, that was my decision from the start. If it helps, I'm not just following orders. And don't feel like you dragged me into this either. But then, why? I just don't think retirement's in the cards for me. Sure. Maybe I could stop and settle down. But I'd rather put what time I've got left to work. Work? Doing what? Running around on the government's leash? Instead of that, how about you stop running away from reality? I think I'm gonna hit the shower. <laughs> when I'm out, we'll rock, paper, scissors. See who gets the floor. <laughs> Is 
he for real? Hey, Guska, you okay? Yeah. I know the guy's basically a superhero or whatever, but that's just crazy. I mean, he's got cancer. Once he's out of the shower, let's try to convince him to go to the hospital again. There's a pretty big one here in town. No, it's useless. No one be enough to stop him now. Huh? Kiryu son, he had the same look in his eyes as Arakawa son. See you tomorrow, Ichi. I see now. They're the same. He had already made up his mind, too. What, 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 what do you mean? Who did? Uh, actually, it's kind of hard to explain. Anyhow, if that's how Kiryu-san wants it, then there's only one thing we can do. We get this taken care of quick as possible, then get him to a hospital. Sound good? What? Man, I just don't get you guys. Think about it. If you up and die, it's all over. <sighs> this shit's crazy, man. I hope Kiryu doesn't die, but like, you know, I'm like preparing for it because it's going to be kind of crazy. All right, let's get moving. What? Are you still upset? No, I'm not upset. Still, it did catch me off guard. I just didn't want you guys to worry. Sorry. Guess I only made you more concerned. Well, I mean, how could we not be? But curious on. Hmm? Seriously. Thanks for telling us. If I didn't know and something happened to you, I would have never been able to forgive myself. To be honest, I'd rather drop everything and take you to the hospital straight away. That said, I know how stubborn you are. So, for my sake, do you think you can rely on us a little more? Rely on you? I'm not about to treat you like you're on your deathbed, but we're here too, you know? So, share the load. We got your back. This way, you won't push yourself too hard and we'll stay happy, right? Right. Mm, I see. All right. Yeah, I'll try to do that. For what it's worth, your help means a lot. Both of you. <laughs> Just doing what we can. Yeah? Definitely. Happy to help. Right, enough chit-chat. Where to? Good question. We still have a bit of time before our meeting. There's no telling what we'll be up against. Make sure you're ready for anything. Tomizawa, is there a good place to go shopping around here? Hmm. How about the Anaconda Shopping Center? Close to District 5, and they got pretty much everything. Cool. Stock up there first. All right. Yeah, that was a lot to take in. Oh, shit, look at these guys. I don't want to fight these guys. So we got to go to some shopping center. Yeah, this map's actually really big. Like, at first I thought it was kind of small, but there's actually so much spots here. Okay, we got to go to the shopping center. Oh, yeah. Oh. Where did this guy come from? What's up? <sighs> when was each one holding that? I see. Oh, we can upgrade our stuff now. Thanks. 
Yeah. Okay, nice. I like how each one just has that bet out of nowhere. Mm. Where are those guys going? Alright. I miss the chick from the old game, man. That repair your stuff. Okay, let's go over here. Oh, yeah. Our little bicycle. Let's get going. Let's roll. Oh shit! Show me what you got. Where these guys come from? What the hell? Holy shit! These guys are crazy. Okay, use. I need this more. Yeah, Grand Liner is really not that good. Did I really miss that? Okay. Shaw breaker. Here we go. Oh shit! There's no way to fight. Damn. Yeah, I don't know how carriers work. Like, actually, we're all like drunk and shit. I didn't realize. Oh shit! Like, nice. I should know my Damn. Is it random for like little, like quick coming back to cure you? Damn, you guys are crazy. Alright. Get out of here. I think this guy's so like slippery. Oh, Kira's no longer drunk. Okay. Kira's basic attack is just crazy, better than his abilities. Damn. These guys are nuts. Alright. Get out of here. Get him out of here. You have no money? Alright. Let's get some upgrading done. Oh yeah, our bike. Yeah, this she has a battery, so I'm not sure. Oh shit. Can I avoid these guys? Oh, never mind. I don't know if I can do this. Hell man. I think we're done here. I just realized jawbreaker's 20? Jesus Christ. Okay, I need to stop using that move. I just realized that these cost the same. Here I come. One of these. That shit's crazy, actually. Here we go. All right. I don't use B style enough. Time to take out the rush. Okay. Oh shit! There's so many guys here. Can I move them? Okay, there we go. Oh yeah. Okay, return. Ow. Cool. Not an enemy in sight. All right, can we actually just get there now? I think we're good. Yeah, it sucks that like yeah, this you run into enemies more often since you're just going straight. If you're like auto cruising. This is the garage the bartender told us about, huh? Hey, what do you want? Huh? Where'd that voice come from? Yeah, I'm over here. Uh. Whoa! Customers, what seems to be wrong with the vehicle? Oh, uh, actually, I'm here about my baseball bat. Well, there's your problem. That's not a car. Yeah, I realize that, uh, but... Wait, hold on! Revolve's bartender sent us. He said there's a one-of-a-kind mechanic here. Hmm... Ugh, why didn't you say that up front? I wasted a whole song and dance on you. Oh, so am I in the right place? If the bartender sent you, yes. We can offer a selection of non-vehicular maintenance services. Name's Julie. I'm Ichiban Kasuga. Nice to meet you. Uh, so, shall I take a look at this bat? Please. Wow! Guy your age still walks around with a skullcracker like this? That's old school. In a cringy kind of way. Thanks. You can help, then? I'm used to modding guns, swords. <laughs> a bat is child's play by comparison. 
<sighs> oh well, let's get on with it. What were you thinking? Show me. Damn, straight to business. What is it now? Okay, so let's see. Oh, you can upgrade the hero bat more. Let's see. Oh, so you transform it? I remember this was really good. That's kind of cool how... Okay, let's see. Yeah, I like this. I remember this was really good in the first game. Okay, so do I have to? Can I just skip or do we have to go down the list? What if I tried? Ha! Shut up! I'm thinking! I like how she's the complete opposite of the other character. A character's. little more. Like the other one was like super this energetic. Is even better. And she's just down for business, you know? Good. Damn. Holy it's barely the same bat anymore. I got bored halfway through fixing it up, so I made some improvements. Better leverage here. It'll be a much deadlier instrument now. So, satisfied? Yeah, I'm satisfied. It's so much easier to handle. I feel stronger somehow just from holding it. You're a miracle worker. No wonder the barkeep said you're the best he knows. Well, that was nothing special. Certainly nothing he couldn't do. What'd you say? Nothing. You heard nothing. Hey, Missy. I'm helping someone else right now, but the exit door is free to assist you. Don't test me, honey. Damn. I'm not going to get around. I get some service. As I've already told you, we only work on vehicles here. Come back when you need an oil change. Enough bullshit. Everybody knows this is a weapon shop. Quit screwing with me. Even if this were the place you think it is, I reserve the right to refuse service to whomever I so choose. Leave. Fucking brat. Damn. That's how you want to play it. <gasps> now give me some goddamn service, girl. Hey, you need to calm down. Hell, who are you? Just a customer. She's replacing my alternator. Settle down and I'm sure she'll be with you soon, yeah? You fucking tourist. <laughs> you got no idea where you are, do you? All right. How about I shoot you? Then I won't be cutting the line. Well, damn, that does sound reasonable. Let's try it. <laughs> You're a dead man. No oh, shit, we took it outside. We're like, yeah, let's oh, not fight wait, inside. Wait, time out. Yeah. All right. Let's beat this oh, guy's ass. Oh, he's weak against this. Oh, yeah. Here we go. Damn, give him a little stomp. Yeah. Should we just finish off one of these? Damn, this guy's actually kind of strong. Damn. <laughs> Why do you make that noise? Okay. Alright, here you finish it off. Oh, 10 bucks? Nice. You're, you're so strong! This shop's off limits to you from now on. Got it? <laughs> Got it. Sorry, you won't see me again. Damn, he's out of there. Okay? Jesus. <sighs> Happens sometimes. Word gets around. The kind of men who look for trouble are good at finding it. Still, I can usually turn them away without much difficulty. Appreciate you taking the bullet for me, though. So to speak. Oh, yeah, sure. I guess with skills like yours, a lot of guys would be interested in coming here. Mm-hmm. But my rule is only people the bartender gives the okay to. Huh. You and the bartender go back long? No, not very long, but well, a lot's happened. I'm renting the space from him, actually. He's technically in charge. Is that right? He owns more than Revolve Bar, then, huh? Anyway, if it isn't clear, I'd like to keep our weapons work under wraps. I expect your discretion. Well, I suppose if the bartender trusts you, I should too. <laughs> we good, old man? Yeah, of course. All right if I come around again? Sure, you were useful today. I'll help you out. Only thing is, next time I'll have to charge, and you'll need to supply your own materials. If that's fine by you, 
Come again anytime. Oh, one more thing. Over in the Anaconda Center, there's a colleague of mine. I'll let them know you're allowed there too. Got it. Thanks a lot. Looking forward to seeing you again, Julie Chan. Julie Chan? Oh, sorry, force of habit. Does that sound strange? No, no, I get it. It's a Japanese thing. I've just never heard that applied to me. I'm kind of flattered, honestly. Yeah, well, just let me know if it's weird. No, don't worry. It's fine. Cool. Julie Chan it is, then. <laughs> You're a funny guy. I'm surprised. Oh, there's a revolved bar guy. What's he doing? Mm. <laughs> He's just gonna make some noise. What's his deal, man? I, I wonder what his deal is. Welcome. He has to have like some crazy backstory. What is it now? All right. So I was gonna upgrade this. Let's see. Yeah, I like this weapon. I'll start right now. What if I tried? Ha! Shut up. I'm thinking. A little more. This is even better. Good. Oh well, yeah. I don't know time. how she turned my bat to that shit. That shit's crazy. Are you stupid? Please. What the hell? So that guy was like, are you stupid? And she was like, no. That shit scared the hell out of him. Oh. Okay. Damn. That fear shit's kinda crazy. It's cool how like if you upgrade your weapons, it adds like the elements to them. Which is kinda nice. I hit someone? Oh shit, this guy does a lot now with the upgrade. I don't know how carry you man, like does he just not get any weapons? That kinda sucks. I might switch out his stance too. As cool as like Dragon Dojum is. Like, I do wanna have like other classes, you know. Oh shit. This guy's might kill me. Here we go. Okay. Y'all so weak. Okay, he's no longer fear. Yeah. Yeah, we do a lot now. Alright. Dude, why does this guy keep missing? Trigger happy. Alright. So here we are. The shopping center should be here. Hopefully we can just get some cool stuff. What's a whole little district kind of? Let's probably hop off this thing. Do I even have money to buy upgrades and stuff? Aloha. Oh shit. Okay, we can buy t-shirts. Let's see. We do need some better gears. What is this? 70 bucks. I feel like I can buy... Let's buy one. That's the Ichiban. We'll buy another one actually if I'll give Kiryu that. Damn, we're broke. Let's see. Oh, this one gives. Hang on, never mind. I thought they give magic damage. This one does, though. Fuck it, we'll give it to this guy. Here we go. Thank you for stopping by. Alright, hopefully the mission doesn't need us to spend money. We can step on the escalator. Does it actually take us up? Oh, shit. Kiryu's just walking up. Alright. Oh, there's a side quest right here. Nope, it's probably gonna make me do those side quests. This is actually kind of cool. <laughs> is District 5 gonna be like some crazy ass section? What the hell is this? What are the odds? Alright. Yeah, there's a side quest here. Oh. Okay. So, yeah, we'll do this. See what this is all about.
Whoa, there. You okay? I'll hold it steady, so set it down for a sec. Yeah, sorry. Could you? And there. Oh, sorry again, and, and, and thanks for the help. This was even heavier than I thought it'd be. Ah, don't sweat it. Besides, aren't you a famous singer? You got a whole crew working for you, so shouldn't you just let them handle it? If you get hurt, you can't play your uke anymore. And if you can't play, it's game over. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you got me there. Uh, yeah, th this event was kind of a rush job, so, so we don't have much staff working it. I, I just didn't want to make any more trouble for them. But that'd defeat the point if I got injured, so yeah. Nah, you're a real nice guy, aren't you? Like, even though you made it big, none of that fame went to your head. A and the fact that you're considerate of your staff? Mad respect. <laughs> nah, you're exaggerating. <laughs> Not at all. He's right, you know. Huh? Yeah, you're always trying to help us out even after pouring your heart and soul into your performance. Now that the show's over, it's time for us to step up to the plate. Hey, you ought to take a break. Relax. I just feel like there's more I could be doing. But you're right. I should step back. And thank you so much for earlier. It'd be great to see you again at another one of my shows. Yeah, for sure. I'll be looking forward to it. Good luck, man. Oh shit, where did these guys come from? Yeah, I like how most of these like side missions are like multiple parts. So like, you can run back into them. This guy wants to fight I'll here? Suit. Really? Okay. I'll suit you. <laughs> that shit's so funny. Here we go. Okay. I didn't even do anything wrong. I just walked over here. Alright. I guess he could sue me for this. Whoa. Jesus Christ. Alright. Like here just feels kind of weaker, huh? It's cause like he doesn't have any weapon now. Alright. Grandliner. I'm just gonna keep using this move. Grandliner isn't really that good. It costs too much. And it doesn't really hit much people. You gotta get like lucky. Oh shit. Cool. Okay. Let's keep spamming this. Break yourself. Oh shit! I messed it up. I still killed him. Guard, really? All right. I think this breaks his guard. Got you now. Damn. Come on. Dinner bell. Take this. Something wrong. Damn, he's fucking that shit up. Yeah. His defense is lower. Oh, but gain hella attack though. All right. Open one. Damn man. Even guarding that shit did a lot. Oh he's burning now. I'll see you later. Oh, okay. Okay, now that burning is gonna kill him. Here we go. Look at each one, he's still on the ground. I think I'm getting stronger. Is this weapon shop? Oh shit. Aloha. Oh, this is. Hang on. Okay, I can't even buy any of this stuff, so. I don't know why I was even looking. All right, can I get out of here? There's a clothing store here. Yeah, I don't think I want to spend much money right now since I already spent a shit ton. Kind of broke. <laughs> this guy looks so funny in this like chill outfit. Yo, Kasuga, Aloha. What's going Aloha, me? What are you doing here? Didn't I tell you? Hawaii hosts a notorious Sujiman Wait, tournament. this goes all the way in Japan last time we met him. Make no mistake, that's the only reason I'm here. This is no vacation, my boy. This is entirely in the interest of... Suji science. So, what's the tournament like? In cases such as these, seeing might prove necessary to believing. Follow me. Okay. Ah, 
hello there. How can I help and you? And this guy's kind of jacked. Holy shit. Who's that Sujiman? Understood. Please take the elevator. Choosing your starter, what the hell? What the hell? Indeed. It's an underground coliseum. The Sujiman Stadium. I can hardly believe it. Home of the Suji League, where rival Sujiman trainers come to compete. The guests put money down on who'll win. Really, it's not all that dissimilar from underground gambling in Japan. Honolulu has strict gambling laws. It's ironic. Those restrictions only drive certain kinds to create such remarkable facilities as this. Hawaii has more to it than meets the eye, huh? Of course. The matches are broadcast worldwide on the dark web. The wealthy can watch and gamble at their leisure. Look! There's a match going on right now. What a fight! The challenger Masato is struggling against the mighty Discreet Force Jack! He's down to his last mon! Damn, this is actually kind of crazy. Oh, no! Come on, hang in there, buddy! <sighs> <laughs> is that really it? Finish it. Kill him if you want. No, buddy! That all you got? Give up yet? <laughs> no. <laughs> I quit. It's over! Like the rest of the foursome, Jack's team of Sujimon remains untouchable! <sighs> This really is the Suji League. Jeez. Battles are fought with teams of three non, led by their Sujimon trainer. Victory goes to the trainer whose Sujimon defeat their opponents. A three-on-three -three Sujimon clash is considered the classic Sujimon battle. Hence, the Suji League uses these to determine their greatest trainer. Trainers, of course, are the brave adventurers who catch Sujimon, develop their skills, and create a cohesive team. Isn't this kind of like slavery because the they're actual people? And leads them to victory. That one we saw, Jack, is among the league's highest ranked trainers and a member of the fearsome Discreet Four. And sitting atop that hedonistic foursome, the ultimate Sujimon master, King. King, huh? Look at him. Oh, no time for that now. The match is starting. Good luck. Thanks. Wait, huh? Good luck doing what? Now we present a rookie match. In the silver corner, a man so saddled with debt. He's resorted to Sujimon battles to stay afloat! Koichi Ideno! And his opponent in the gold corner, the former Yakuza Kum Taurus who never stays down! Ichibon Kasuga! Uh, me? What the hell's going on, Sensei? I'll admit I've always been the type to beg forgiveness than ask permission. I'll explain later. You just need to win! Wait, win? But this is a Sujimon battle, right? Sensei, I haven't got any Sujimon. Worry not, my boy. I've called in some old friends. Here they come now. Hello, Sensei. Oh, hello to you, chum. Hi there. Name's Yasuo Sodachi, at your service. And from the Sodachi Dojo, me, his student Karaki. And I'm his most positive and energetic student, Yokawa. Who the hell are these guys? Yasuo Sodachi-san and his students. Sodachi-san was my closest confidant when I was champion. And a Sujiman in his own right. Back in those days, I ran a gym, but it sorta... went bust. 
Thankfully, the Sujimon Sensei came to my rescue. And now that he's offered to cut me a little check, I'm here to help him out once more. The Sodachi-san was a master of his dojo. He excels at training and strategy. A beginner could ask for no better ally. So, you're Ichiban's Kasuga. Nice to meet you. Ichiban. Ichiban Kasuga. <laughs> the hell? Oh, shit. Must have been a bad connection. Anyway, have no fear. Even a Suji League novice is in good hands with me. <clears throat> I hate to interrupt, but Kasuga team, everyone's waiting. Your opponents don't look so tough. Just give Sodachi son and his boys some guidance and trust them. You can win. Seriously? Jeez. You better not give me any crap if I lose. And without further ado, this Sujimon League rookie match. So, how does this short? Is this like the regular game? This game's already turn based. Okay, let's see. Bow. Let's give it everything we got. Everyone ready? All right, boys. Charge! Oh shit, that's kind of cool. This is the big one. Okay. Which Sujimon trainer will fortune favor? What the hell? Okay, Ichiban's turn. So in command to attack. Which trainer will achieve victory? Which Sujimon will be sent to the glue bar? Okay, this guy's gonna attack. What is this? What the hell? <laughs> Shit's so weird. Ah, uh, so different elements and stuff. Maybe I should read this since this is so different. Okay. Come my turn again. Here comes a doozy. We got this down. What's that Sujimon got in their bag of tricks? The trainers reconsidering the lineup for their life choices. Well, we almost have our special attack. I think. Okay, let's use that. What is this? So we gotta get the red. Oh, I can't get the red. Oh, no, <laughs> mommy did. Oh shit, that's actually kind of cool. I'm pretty sure you probably get like the older characters from the other game as a Sujimon. The winner is the Maybe probably has like the DLC or something. Oh, we did it! Sweet, sweet victory. Whew. How the hell did we do that? <laughs> well done, my boy. I knew you had what it takes. Knew it in my bones. Couldn't. Wait, that guy, that's Professor Morikasa, isn't it? Uh, oh shit, it's really him, the former champion! I thought the Suji League expelled him, didn't they? But he's back now, or isn't he? How intriguing! The Sujimon League's prodigal champion, Morikasa, has returned! Bugger all. Time to go, Kasuga. Uh, okay, okay. Morikasa-san. That's cool. Like, that. there's a whole storyline to this if you just, like, beat them all. <sighs> that got out of hand, Kasuga. I'm sorry. No shit! The hell was all that? I need some details here, Sensei. Right. I owe you that. The truth is, I'm the former Suji League champion. Oh, <laughs> it was a different time. The gambling wasn't so rampant. Back then, the League was a true test of skill. That was the Suji League that I loved. I was proud to be its champion. 
But since the Suji League Committee was established, gambling's devoured the soul of the competition. The Suji League Committee? Uh, did you see those folks in the weird pervert masks? That's them. They run the bets and skim off the top of every battle. Gradually, they started fixing matches to accommodate their wealthiest clients. As soon as I heard, I rallied against them. But they were too powerful. They exiled me from the League and claimed total authority. I can't believe all this. Truthfully, my plan from the start has been to restore the League. Make it the place of honor and glory it was before. I loved it once, my Suji League. I can't stand seeing it corrupted like this. So then, what's the plan? There's only one option. Be the very best. Become Suji League Master and win the championship. The champion's influence can be immense. If one wins the favor of the crowd, they could oust the committee itself. <coughs> but you said they exiled you before. That's why. I need to battle in your place? That's right! Please, Kasuka, will you do this for me? Why does it have to be me? What about Sadachi-san here? He's got way more experience than me. Sadachi-san's not a bad trainer, but he's never been popular with the fans. I mean, doesn't he just have that dull-witted creator-wrestler look about him? Is that really how people see me? Kasuga, though... You have a knack for Sujiman and charisma to boot. Putting together a team is what you excel at. I don't know. The committee possesses terrifying wealth, you know. They've ruined the lives <coughs> of countless poor Sujimon, all swallowed up by the system. And I am the Sujimon Sensei. As I told you before, I seek world peace. Not only for normal folk, however, for my Sujimon brethren as well. I want to break the cycle of mistreatment and exploitation of my kind. I'm asking a lot, I know, but you're the only one who can help. Hmm. All right. When you put it like that, I can't just walk away. Kasuga, you're really in? Uh, frankly, I don't understand all the details here. But <coughs> I know you're not a bad person, Sensei. If you say this matters to you, I'll help. Kasuga, words fail me. <laughs> hey, hey, come on, old man. It's all right. <laughs> but I'm just so happy. <laughs> Cry when someone else cries. Oh no! Ah! <laughs> okay, okay. So, for the most part, I get how the Suji League works, but I'll still need more Sujimon, right? Hmm. You'll want three starters and three for the bench. That's at least six in total. So Dachi san and his pupils are three, so I have to double my stock, basically. How am I supposed to do that? That's easy. Just smack them around until they give in. Kick them, punch them. Violence takes care of everything. What? It really has to be that rough? Well, his explanation is somewhat crude, but not entirely wrong. Sujiman classically obey those who assert dominance. This will be easier to learn by doing. Oh, it seems there's a raid happening nearby. A raid? It's a gathering spot for strong Sujimon, where they battle one another to establish a native pecking order. Kasuka, go over there and flex. D why Look, raid dwellers respect strength. They naturally defer to the most gallant among them. If you don't want to flex, find some other way to display your vim and vigor, and then <coughs> win their hearts. Just... Start by introducing yourself, all right? Oh, and take some of these. What are these? This is how we capture them, like the Pokeballs. I model them after traditional year-end presents. Didn't your parents give you any as a child? Wait. Right. I'm sorry. Anyway, get 
to it, Sujimon Master Kasuga. I'll give it a shot. Okay, so we get to choose one of our starters. Let's go with the fire type. What the hell? Oh, we're fighting like regular? Oh shit, our boys are here. Okay. Looks like I'm up. Oh shit. Cool. Why was he screaming when he dodged? Holy shit. Dude, this guy's crazy. Allow me. There's no way he's gonna dodge Kiryu too. Okay, there we go. Go ahead. Size up. Dude, why is he just dodging everyone? Jesus Christ, alright. Got one of these. Oh, should we get a hundred from that? Hey, fight's over, man. So, what are we doing? Should we just give him one of these? Show him you care. There you go. Take this, a peace offering. Are you serious? Are you trying to pay me off? What the hell? <laughs> what the fuck is this? Guess you're the boss now. Damn, okay. He looks so evil, but now he looks better now. Alright! I caught a Sujiban! Uh, or, or something like that. <laughs> well done, Kasuga. That's the way. From now on, if a Sujiman hangs around after defeat, try recruiting them to your team. Just remember that not all Sujiman will join you. Consult this list here to see who's eligible. Take a look at it now. Okay. I think I get it. But don't I also have to help them get stronger? A simple way to improve your Sujiman is to shove some Suji munch down their gullets. However, it's better to raise them up in battle. If you spot rival trainers in the city, try taking them on. As you defeat other trainers, your ranking in the league will increase. At a high enough rank, you can even challenge the fearsome discreet four. The current champion, King, sits at the very top of that peak. You'll have to dispatch the rest first. Is this gonna take long, you think? Nah, with me by your side, it'll be a cakewalk. Let's go grind, knock out the four, and then we'll all take a trip to Suji Land. <laughs> there, there's not really a Suji Land, right? So don't you say? One more thing. Let me install the Suji League app on your phone. You should find it quite useful. All right. Guess I'll give it a shot. Thank you, Kasuga. This is it. You must travel across the land, searching far and wide. Catch Sujima, become a man. I'll wait here inside. Uh, are those lyrics? It, it's it's uh, something I've been working on. Uh, forget it. Go catch those mons, Kasuga. All right. So that's that. Such a random mission. Okay. Interesting. We'll probably do that like way later. Having like no interest in doing that shit at all. Sorry. You guys just waiting while I was doing all that shit. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so it's recommend level 13. Oh shit. What level am I? What level 12? We're not that far behind. So should we start like grinding out? Oh shit. It's kind of pricey though. I'm gonna buy this. Do this to Ichiban. Okay. Thank you. So should we grind out before we continue on the main story? I don't even know. Let's see. 
I don't even know how do you grind. Like in the other game, you had the little like shopping wall where you can like fight random people, you know? Okay, let's fight these guys. The hell? What's going on? Oh, his people ran away. Oh, we got Mega Swing. What? Oh yeah, man. Oh yeah. Look at that man. That move is so crazy. Yeah, it was my favorite move in the game. Apparently, it does more if each one's low. But it's just good no matter what. Taxi driver pro tip: It's easier to pick up customers in front of a pastry. No one wants to risk hoofing it while lugging around a whole cake. Oh, that's a good point. Uh, which is exactly why I know where all the bakeries are. No idea which are good, though. Just when I thought you were finally going to offer some valuable information. We're really opening up. Oh, shit. I wonder what you gave. You get, like, bingo. Is that when you get, like, the bar talk, maybe? All right. But I think I'm going to end this part here. Next part's going to actually be crazy. Like... I don't know, it took a while to actually get to the Barricada hideout. Because we had so much going on. Let's go and save. Oh yeah. Alright, we'll see you guys next part.